Hello, JNM here with the shoot animation tutorial for the low poly blender Canon model, again a very short video. This is the open close action that we added in the previous part, where the opener bone is rotated around the Y axis. Ok, cool, now let's create a new action and I call this one shoot. I turn to pose mode and select the root bone and then I press the I key to add the first keyframe for location and rotation. After that I snap the view to right auto and then I go to frame number 3 and press the R key to rotate the whole cannon upwards. And a new keyframe is inserted because we still have the auto keyframe insertion enabled. I want to keep this pose for the next frame as well, so I press again the I key to insert it to frame 4. Alright, then I move to let's say frame number 11 and I set the rotation to the initial value and this looks like as the cannon is falling back onto the ground after shooting. In the next frames I let the cannon kind of bounce a bit up and down to add this realistic behavior when it hits the ground again. So I just add a very small rotation upwards. At frame number 20 I set the end frame of the animation and I insert the current pose here. Ok, this looks quite nice already. I set the end frame to 20 in the timeline as well and we can play it now in a loop. Great, but to let the movement appear a bit more natural I go to this frame here and add a small rotation by pressing the R key. I rotate it very slightly to the side and when I play this now you can see this looks more realistic, especially when it bounces on the ground. Alright guys, we are done and I'm sure this comes out really impressive when we add it to Unity, to my low poly game kit, we will also add audio for the shot and some smoke and of course we're gonna shoot a cannonball with it. So stay tuned for the next one when we bring it into the game engine. Don't forget to subscribe and you're notified when the next part is available and consider supporting me as my patron because this really helps this channel grow. If you have any questions add these to the comments below. Thanks for watching and I'll see you on JNM.